Hi everybody, uh, my name is Jason DeWild, I'm the Head of Audio here at the Australian Institute of Music and welcome to another micro lecture. So this is part of the How To series and today we're going to be learning about how to record an electric guitar with just a single microphone. It's all those, it's aimed for those home studio enthusiasts that need to get the best sound that they can out of an electric guitar. Let's take a look. Okay, so um, with, a, with a, a recording electric guitar with a single microphone, the main thing is about the positioning of it. Okay, so let me first have a look at the mic itself though. This is um, a Shure SM57, um, a very, very common microphone used for electric guitar. Um, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move the position of the mic and just moving it a few inches is gonna make a huge difference to the sound itself, okay? So you think about the position as almost being like a tone control. Okay, so um, you can't see it this well, but the speaker cone actually comes like here, all right? And there are two speaker cones as part of, it, part of this cabinet. Now, if you move the mic to the center of the speaker cone, you're going to find that it's very, very trebly. You're going to actually get a lot of top end into that sound. As you move it further to the side of the cone, uh, you're going to find that the sound will drop off in top end, just like turning down the treble on an EQ. Okay? So, closer to the center, very, very bright. As you move it further away, the top end will disappear uh, quite considerably. The other thing that also happens is that you can actually change the tone by moving the distance of the microphone from the cabinet itself. The further away you are, you're going to find that there is less bass in the sound, okay? So you're moving it further away and you'll get less bass. As you move it closer to the mic, uh, sorry, closer to the cabinet, there's the, what's called the proximity effect will start to take uh, place. And the closer you get to it, the more increase in bass that you're going to have. So really the positioning of this mic is all about um, basically being like a, a glorified tone control. Okay, so what we're going to do, that's the explanation. Let's now hear how that sounds. And so we've got Jace here. Um, so Jace, what I need you to do is just play a, a single kind of area um, and I'll just now move the microphone around as we go. Good on you, mate. Thanks. Okay, so by changing the position of the microphone, you're acting it like a tone control, and it's about you finding the right position for the particular sound. Basically means you don't really need to use EQ in the control room, it's all about the positioning of the microphone. Hope you enjoyed that micro lecture, we'll see you next time. Thanks a lot.